Hello everybody, this is Ashwin here uh, and this time I'm gonna be doing a tutorial on how to root your Galaxy Note phone. So uh, the thing is, uh, I have been receiving a few requests for me to do this tutorial and the reason I've not actually gone ahead with it is because it's a huge pain for me to unroot my phone and you know show you how it's actually done. So this time I'm not gonna actually unroot my phone, I'm gonna, my phone is rooted and it's gonna remain rooted. I'm just going to show you what exactly needs to be done because the steps are extremely simple and uh, if you're going to follow my method you're going to end up with a rooted Galaxy Note and Clockwork Recovery Mode installed so if you're looking for just the root and you don't want Clockwork Recovery you can go ahead and follow the link, link number one it will have the uh, options to do that as well uh, for those who don't know what Clockwork Recovery is that helps you to flash ROMs ROMs are like, you know, uh, ROMs are like, what do you say, versions of uh, Android that have been modified uh, by various developers. So a lot of these, some of the ROMs, uh, people use different ROMs to, you know, uh, get rid of the bloatware that comes with uh, some carriers, you know, they have their carrier specific uh, apps installed and that hogs your memory, drains battery, utilizes CPU resources. So for various reasons people do end up you know going after different ROMs so if you're gonna do that this is the tutorial you need to be following because uh, once you for once once we're done we're gonna have a rooted phone with clockwork recovery mod installed okay so here goes so the first thing uh, you need to do is click on the link link number one okay before you do that okay go into settings uh, go into applications make sure unknown sources are selected and go into development and make sure USB de debugging is selected and uh, once you check these go down to about phone and you go down to the kernel version so if you can see my version there's something called KL8 that it ends at so your kernel versions could end at something similar something like KJ1 or KJ4 uh, KK1 or you know something like that so you just need to note that down make sure you select you're looking at the kernel version this one right here okay and uh, note that down and that's it connect connect your phone with your charging cable the USB cable just use it plug your phone in connect it to the computer leave it as it is so the next thing you need to do is click on the link number one that I've given you and that would take you to this side okay so at this side you just go ahead and select whatever download whatever kernel that you have just select the relevant download for it okay and once you once the file is downloaded you just hit extract and you're gonna end up with something like this okay there are gonna be four uh, files over here files the image already rooted not rooted yet okay now all you need to do is make sure your phone is connected to the computer and you have uh, you follow the steps till now and just hit not rooted yet dot bat and follow the on-screen instructions and that's pretty much it you just need to hit any key my phone is not gonna connect connected now so it's not gonna do anything but this is all you need to do once you're done with this your phone is rooted you've got clockwork recovery mod installed and you're good to go Okay, I know this has been a small tutorial. Uh, I've not actually shown you how the routing gets done, but I've given you the theory on what you need to do. You just need to click this and just follow the instructions on screen and you'll be good to go. So uh, if you have any questions whatsoever, don't hesitate to message me, leave a comment. I'll get back to you within a day. Uh, we'll make sure that your phone gets routed as quick as possible. Uh, another important thing is the moment you get your phone routed, make sure you, you install titanium backup. Uh, this would be titanium backup just a minute so this is titanium backup make sure you get that installed and make sure uh, once you've installed it it's gonna ask you for super user for uh, rights just go to backup restore and backup everything do a batch backup of everything so you know back up all user apps and system data just just run that one so that even you flash your flash anything or if you if you mess up anything in the future you're not gonna lose any data and once the phone is back up you know 
just to make sure that you have so you have a uh, clockwork mod you, you will find something called TWM in your app draw and you will find super user if you see these two icons in your app draw it means that everything's gone as per plan and your phone is rooted right now so there's nothing for you to worry about so that's it for now if you have any queries please go ahead and uh, leave a message I will get back to you or a comment I mean you can follow me on Twitter at curse forever uh, if you like this video please cl please click like hit subscribe uh, thanks for watching you guys have a great day bye bye